What's rocking guys here be taking a look at Bruno Zuccolini the 22 year old center man who starts at a 74 overall He really is kind of a complete midfielder from the start You can see all the green here when it comes to physical stats mental stats and technical stats play information real quickly Six foot center mid slash right mid right foot with medium medium work rates three star weak foot and two star skill moves So uh, you can play some right mid uh, he'd be very uh, kind of a two-way midfielder will really help a lot on uh, Defensively, you know with that marking like most likely as well as the tackling you know, that is useful because it seems like the uh, wingers do defend a lot more in this game this year. Because he's up to an 83 overall uh, in year, 22, tw year 2020, excuse me, and the growth was tremendous physically. Uh, improved a lot in his strength, was a bit, which was a bit low, as well as stamina is up there. A lot of dark green physically. He's pacey, agile, has great mental stats, ball control, dribbling are up there, uh, as well as some great passing, marking, and tackling stats. That is just a complete midfielder, uh, being only 83 overall in year 2020, uh, just basically... Uh, five years after the start of uh the the game excuse me i don't know what i'm trying to say but uh you can see either way uh you could play very well in the attack you know run at the defense as you can see here uh just use some of that dribbling now takes a long shot for us to say good save uh, and you saw in that first highlight you kind of stayed a bit out wide cut back in use some of that that ability uh physically to create a chance for himself as well and you see that long shot is pretty solid i uh, had some good long shots and as you can see he kept on uh taking a swing at them as well even though that some for some reason showed uh, Salnez, even though uh, that was actually Zuccolini taking the shot. Either way, you can see him now winning the ball. Now he's going to be able to play a good pass. They're showing a little bit of that two-way ability there in that instance. But again, now you can see him running at the defense, uh, showing some of that ability. Now he decides to lift that ball over the top, which is perfectly set to break the defense. Uh, you can see he's 86 over on now, age 30, uh, looking great uh, with more additions to his physical and technical stats. He could really play on the wing out now Now with that ball control. Jeremy, of course, does not, just does not have that skill moves, unfortunately. But uh, I think he may Maybe get to get over that with that tremendous mix of pace as well as ball control dribbling as the dribbler playmaker and acrobat specialties at the moment now so there's certainly some great stats and of course passing stands out as well but he would continue to grow after this as you will continue to see uh, here in this uh, these next two highlights you'll see where he ends up uh, at at year 2025 basically as well as uh, the, at the age of 33 because he would actually continue to grow into that point which was tremendous to see one of the first times I've actually seen that his players generally for me seem to just lose like all their stats uh, once they hit like 30 or so but so you can see 87 overall now age 31 um, great stats mental stats went up quite a bit as well as ball control dribbling again uh, passing um, looking great as well but you see 80 overall now in age 33 is what he would cap out as some tremendous work from him more additions to some of those uh, key stats and he just really is a complete midfielder uh, and I really would recommend taking a look at him guys but uh, with that thanks for tuning in I'll be signing out now and I'll catch you guys later